so we need to bypass this screen yeah okay and here is the message the sim card inserted to this iPhone does not appear to be supported sure what we need to do we need to open Red Snow Black Ops Red Snow um, Extras Select IPSW Select older uh, IPSW 6.0 This one is supported successfully now go back jailbreak we need to check install Cydia install iPad baseband and go forward so put uh, this device into DFU mode first turn it off when it's turned off and click here Okay, so now it's fetching basement files. Just wait, this, this way. <laughs> I joked, man. <laughs> now it's actually loading the data, jailbreak data, to the iPhone 3GS. Please note, this is a semi-tethered version of jailbreak. It will boot up, but um, Cydia and Twix would not work. This is the magic of Sam Tablet jailbreak. And once again, this amazing logo, pineapple. Don't you just love it, man? Yeah. Okay, so now wait for this to finish and. Uh, now we can go back and, and wait. Or you can just skip the scene and go to eat something and some can cut some slack on the viewers. Yeah, yeah, that would be nice. Uh, so I just installed uh, iPad Basement on iPhone 3GS. So now we can by bypass our activate screen. So let's go here. Unlock. <coughs> go forward. And as you can see, now this button is enabled. We can go forward. Just continue. Dis disable for now. Okay, uh, start up with new iPhone, agree, agree, so we're in, uh, our uh, iPhone is working, now what we need to do is boot tethered, so the CDR will appear here, just turn it off. And go to uh, back. Okay, so select IPSW first. Uh, jailbreak activation firmware 3G, and you need to select older again. Yes, just boot. And I think I'm in DFU mode already. Let's I have two missed calls. <laughs> okay. That's not good.
But yes, that's it. Thanks for watching. So subscribe. Watch us. Bye.